Ending 26. Special theme with a knight s pawn. Copive, 1954. As we already know, near the edge of the board pawns follow their own rules. This is especially true about the rook's pawn, and we will later see some examples dealing exclusively with this. However, there is also much to say about the knight's pawn. There are some stalemate themes that favor the defender, but also an important circumstance that works in the rook's favor, if the defending king is forced to stand in front of his pawn and then moves to the rook file, he can easily be forced in front of his pawn again. The following example is a study by Kopiv that illustrates the special features of the knight's pawn. We will also use it to revise most of the motifs of rook versus pawn endings. Rook e7 c7. A time gaining check. Note that the king and the pawn are placed the same way as in 5.6, that is, the best position to secure the advance, therefore, this check is most annoying end game RP. With this move we can see the problems of the knight's pawn. King c3 d3. Fails to. Rook c7 b7. And white has one time. King d3 c4. King d8 c7. b5 b4. King c7 b6. Outflanking. b4 b3. King b6 a5. King c4 c3. King a5 a4. b3 b2. King a4 a3. A completely successful example of outflanking. King c3 b4. King d8 d7. King c3 b3 The meaning of L Sent b3 is clearly seen in Rook c7 b7 b5 b4 King d8 c7. King b3 c3. And compared to 1, sent d3 2 b7 equals black has won a tempo. King d8 d7. b5 b4. King d7 c6. Would be a typical mistake in view of. King b3 c4. Shoulder charging. King c6 b6. King c4 d3. And now that distractions have ended, it is time to count. Black needs 4 tempi to promote, whereas white needs 5 to control the b1 square with both pieces, therefore, it is a draw. King b6 a5. b4 b3. Rook c7 b7. King d3 c2. King a5 a4. b3 b2. King d7 d6. An important point. The white king approaches the pawn but, at the same time, 
hinders the Black King's way out to the right side of the Knight's Pawn. King b3 b2 King d6 d5 King b3 a4 King d6 c5 King a4 a3 King c5 c4 King b3 a2 Here comes disaster Of course, the black king must get out of the pawn's way but the rook's file is too narrow. King d6 d5 was also winning. Even rook c7 a7 wins. Though a little more awkward, this move shows how annoying it is for black that his king is in front of his pawn. King a2 b2 King d6 c5 King b2 c3 Rook a7 c7 Now this is the only winning move, hindering the black king's right way out. b4 b3 King d6 d5 King b2 a1 King d5 c4 b3 b2 Rook c7 a7 And the black king must obstruct his pawn again, thus losing in the same manner as in the main line, see below. King d6 c5. The c file does not matter anymore. b4 b3. King c5 b4. The white king uses and abuses the awkward position of his black counterpart. Now 5 a 7 plus or 5. Cent c4 would win as well. b3 b2. Rook c7 a7. With any other pawn, the black king could move leftwards, but now he has to obstruct his pawn. King a2 b1. King b4 b3. King b1 c1. Rook a7 c7. King c1 b1. This is another special feature of the knight's pawn, in this case in black stalemate chances. But here it can be avoided. Not. Rook c7 c2. King b1 a1. Not. Rook c7 c2. King c1 b1. This is another special feature of the knight's pawn, in this case in black stalemate chances. But here it can be avoided. Rook c7 b7. Always be careful. King b1 a1. King b3 c2. King b1 c1. King b3 a2. Conclusion. If the defender's king can be forced in front of his knights, or rooks, pawn, his chances are dramatically decreased. Beauty equals 0.0. .0.